Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do an update or a switch out for the two weeks one palette that I am doing this year. It makes room for me to play around with my palettes. So for the last two weeks I have played around with the BH Cosmetics Weekend Festival palette and I have not used every single shade but hopefully when this goes up I have played around with the blues and the purple. I really want to use those before I call it completely quit but I need to pre-film this update so if I have made the looks I will insert them so that is actually my goal let me pull out the looks that I have done so the first look I'm going to talk about is incorporating the orange shade before I pulled out this palette I have only played with the pinks so I wanted to use the orange because I love an orange so you may can see but I used this shade called Hippie and I used Flash, which is the gold and I used Escape, which is this brown and then I used Hipster, which is this dark dark brown. So I think I used those in that first look and then I wanted to use the extreme yellow gold, which is called... Oh my god, I can't say that. You put... Euphoria. Oh my god, I can't say that. That shade right there. I really, really, really like that shade. And I also used... Yeah, I think I used Hippy, Escape and Hipster again. But just another lid shade. Before, I hopefully have used Trans and Palooza. These two blues. And I really want to use Neon as well. Before I take this down. Pull it out, at least. Boho I have used on the lid, but I didn't use any other shades with it, and I don't believe I have a picture of that. But Boho is so, so beautiful. It is a pink base with gold glitter. It reminds me a lot of Cosmopolitan from Makeup Geek that I am trying to pan on right now. So I really, really like that look. It wasn't the biggest difference than the panning look that I am doing at the moment. So... I really really like this palette, it is amazing, so I'm really sad to pull it away, but I need to rotate for my collection because otherwise I just get stuck with the palettes. So let me get the wheel here and let's spin for another one. Urban Decay Vice 4 palette. I am actually trying to pan a few shades in that palette. I just pulled it in for my Harry Potter project pan, so that is really exciting. So, And that can also motivate me to use the other shades that I didn't put in the project. So let me go get that palette and I will be right back. So let's try again. My camera cut me off because I didn't have any space on my memory card. So here is the Urban Decay Vice 4 palette. It was a limited edition holiday palette in... 2015 because I lived in Germany from 2015 until summer 2016 and then I moved back to Denmark if you don't know So this is how the Vice Fall palette looked like in the Harry Potter project pen I have added two shades. It is flame the orangey shade and then Arctic which is this glittery greeny turquoise shade. I really really like those shades and That is why I put them in the project and I wanted to use this palette more and I have also done a palette bingo on this palette. It was the first palette I did a palette bingo on ever. And I'm actually really proud of that look. I really liked it. So if you want to watch it, I will link it up in the cards. And I mainly used the purple shades and then a green on the lower lash line. And I really like Bitter, that shade right there. Which in my mind is one of the only green shades because it's... Not entirely deep like this one called Delete, but it's like a mid-tone brown. You have to be creative um, for your eye looks, but it's, a fun, it's okay. It's going to be fun. I'm excited because I am going to work on those two shades anyway. So this will be a good opportunity to use those shades and then incorporate other shades and just use other shades, basically. Just as I said in the other updates, I am going to use these palettes in the weekend and then I have a panda palette and some other shades that I'm panning in the weekdays. So I'm trying to only use this palette when I do the looks 
in the weekends so that is everything for this video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did please give it a like subscribe down below if you aren't subscribed already i would love for you to stick around i do a lot of these videos and my pretty pants and empties and palapingos i really love uh, the content that I am making right now. I am soon going to film a Q&A so if you have any questions for me please leave them down below in the comments because I have gotten some comments on the community tab because I finally have that and I have gotten one or two questions on Instagram. So let me know if you have any questions for me and until my next video please take care. Bye! And I'm sorry about the cause.